Hi, my name's Sue Green. I'm a freelance mentor for university students with autism. I've been working in the field of autism for about 25 years, um, the last 12 of which as a specialist mentor. And my top tip that I'd like to share with you today is about goal setting. Now, I realise that this isn't going to be applicable to everyone, but I hope that some of you can find some use for it. So basically, um, your goals can be as simple or as complex as you like. So for some people, they really might be very, very small goals, such as making sure that you have a shower in the morning and making sure that you have some breakfast. For other people, they're going to be a bit more complicated. And one of the reasons that this really works is because it gives you a sense of achievement if you know that you've completed the goals that were on your list for any particular day. Um, it also helps to give structure and um, routine to, to your day. So for me, yesterday, my main goals were to do some exercise, to do some batch cooking and to do something creative and fun. So the exercise for me was um, an online version of Joe Wicks. I find that particularly useful because having somebody talk you through the exercises makes you do more than you would if you were doing it just on your own. Um, batch cooking was great because now I've got lots of nice things in the freezer and then finally doing something creative obviously that's going to vary for everyone but one of my particular hobbies is photography so I was making some cards yesterday and um, as they say here's one I made earlier so this is a really nice thing to do give you some um, cards to later use for birthdays or Christmases so I hope that's been helpful and thank you for watching bye